During the year of 2020, the world was faced with the coronavirus. Due to this pandemic, schools were forced to switch to online learning. Today, I spoke with students and teachers from SCOTA Central Catholic about their experience with online learning. Mrs. Dussel talks about what it was like teaching her students from home. Difficult is the first word that comes to my mind. Um, at the time, uh, we didn't really have, we didn't have Teams, so we were using Zoom. Um, and we didn't have a regular schedule to our day. I only really Zoomed with, I tried to Zoom with the group a couple of times and didn't get good results as far as students coming to that. I didn't get good student contact at that point. Uh, partly, I know it was partly my fault because it, it was so new, I didn't really know what to expect, what to do with that, but it was extremely difficult to try to teach from afar. Mrs. Dussel says students struggled with learning from home. Many of my students, it was, it was very difficult to not have that face-to-face -face contact connection kind of thing that we're all very used to. Sydney Quinn is one of the many students who had to learn from home. My experience with online learning was stressful because it was hard to get in contact with the teachers throughout the day when they always had class going on. And it was hard to understand the lessons because if you weren't there in person, then it was hard to comprehend it. In quarantine, I wasn't allowed to see any of my friends, which made me feel lonely. And I wasn't able to ask teachers questions in person. And I missed out on a lot of school experiences. Max Lancaster was another student who had to learn from home. Online learning was pretty difficult at first with many teachers using many different platforms such as Outlook, PowerPoint, and Teams. But I eventually got the hang of it after like two weeks and it, was, it turned out to be like a pretty good system. This 2021 school year, students and teachers had to wear masks and practice social distancing but were allowed to be back in person for school. With the difficulties everyone faced last year, everyone is excited to be back on campus.